Hello, and welcome back to another video. I have actually um, been doing quite a lot of, once I say construction, but not construction, more like deconstruction. Yes, deconstruction. Well, let's have, let's have a look at this first. First of all, uh, let's see the what was. What is the shower room? Now it is kind of not a shower room. Let's have a look. As you can see, the uh, it's all detailed here now. So all oh, that I just need to get that wood down there. Take that off there. Take that off there. The wood. Get the plumber to take this out and take this out. The, all these walls here, dot and dabbed, and re plasterboarded. I've got the new shit, the new um, shower um, ready and waiting. We've got that. We've got the um, new sink and cupboard underneath for this already. It's waiting. Just need to get a new toilet and get that boxed in. It's going to be started soon. Um, and as you know from. Um, which I talked about last time. This basically, um, this wall here is being taken out because currently we're using this as our little um, makeshift uh, lounge. That well, this is the kitchen as you can see. We've de wallpapered it all, literally. With this count new this countertop replaced with a quartz one or granite with that sink there. With that sink there being put there which the sink will end about here They're all plastered again as you can see we've put in a um, extractor fan in there that's being plastered up that's being plastered up new nice um, extractor fan up there nice hidden behind there which looks actually really nice you wouldn't know it was there although you'd expect it being being the fact there's an oven there and there's going to be a hob and you're having all this taken up you're actually having um, Proper floor tiles, dual floor tiles um, for it. Uh, what else is happening? Um, here are the rabbits. There's little Warren there and Luke, Luke in the cage there. As you can see, we keep shuffling everything out around. We've, we've actually just that got um, some uh, new ceiling uh, roses. So this big one is going in the bedroom, the master bedroom. That little one there is going to be going up there. Um, and we've got a nice chandelier um, putting in. Um, basically, I'm, start, I'm starting to paint this room. As you can see, it doesn't need painting more, but I, I've only got so much time because I like to do the edges and the skirting boards and the coving. And then I like once that's dried, I can go over the wall properly and it'll look decent. What have we actually uh, uncovered now? But this is just so good. We went to a place, it was about 180 years old and this house is 200 years old and uh, basically um, we thought we did get a piece of stone as I told you last time from the garden cleaned up for a mantelpiece and we found that how sick is that the original 200 year old um, ar archway for where the original where like they would have put a, a, a stove in there I guess and it is open but how amazing is that and if you look at the back of it, it's going to be massive. I'm going to put a nice, uh, a night, we're going to plaster board it and it's going to look beautiful. And actually, this, this actual, um, uh, this wall here um, is going to be a different colour. We've decided it's going to be green English sage, which is basically like a greeny, a greeny grey. And back in Georgian times, believe it or not, what they did was they didn't bother making the skirting boards, the coving and all that stuff very all white what they did is they weren't finding it around they didn't have time because they're such vast houses they used to paint everything so that shelving unit there all the counters all the um, uh, all that um, chimney vest ones that's been tied in and everything and all that wall there and the skirting boards will all be that english green, sage green ceiling rolls down there will be going up there there's little warrenny little little rabbity rabbit there you are mr mr rabbit and there's little luca Oh, our little two lion head rabbits. Um, so that's that scenario coming on. Let's see about the um, all the wood chip wallpaper. Got to take all this off. We're putting these and put these on sale. These vintage antique light things up sale. Um, basically, 
um, what we are having done then when the joiner comes it's replacing that thing there and putting it on the on there like on, on top of that white thing getting rid of all this these two trunking things getting rid of that keeping this mirroring and making it look nice and um well, the big ceiling rolls as i said before is going to be going up there that massive one downstairs and we go in there we've got a nice big chandelier as well to go there um as you can see we've got a bit of a um a bit of a leak up up there Hence that down there, but this hasn't really changed much either. It's just this, this is the one of the one of the last rooms to be it's going to be started. That light's still got to go downstairs in the dining room, which we currently use as a lounge. We've cleaned all the radiators, so well the bathroom. This has got to come out soon because we're having tiles on the floor very soon. We need to, we need to clean the walls and paint them. And then we need to put that back in. Uh, change these lights in, in that light into some uh, IP67 lights. It's really in this this uh, banister. It stops here. So we're also getting a quote to have that this hollow banister made to look like this one. So it's kind of like in keeping. It'll stop there. The uh, chimney vest has been plastered um, and it looks lovely. I will take a picture of the uh, the final one. So we've done. I've got the before with the back boiler. Back boiler comes out, hole in it, digging it out like it is now, and then what it looks like when it's done. So if you want to follow us on on there, follow us on Lister Family Renovations. You can follow me on there as well. It's just James Lister or five. Um, don't know why people don't just. I've got loads of renovation videos. Follow the process of this house how we're going to basically we're doing most apart from the few trades that we need to have done to make it look nice changing lights painting knocking walls out and um, de-wallpapering um, changing sockets uh, sorting kitchens out just doing loads of stuff ourselves to try and save money on demolishment and demolishing it myself please subscribe um, it's free it's great we'd love it if you can